you may or may not know, my name is Thomas, and I'm going to be teaching strong seniors for you today. Now, what we're going to be doing is we're going to do some AMRAPs, so that's as many rounds as possible. So what I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have my timer, and I'm going to have a set of exercises with you during that time. So I believe this time it's uh, each, we're going to be doing three sets. And each set is going to be 10 minutes long. So in, the, and so in those 10 minutes, you're going to have a set of exercises that you're going to do uh, in those 10 minutes. And once you, once you finish all those exercises, you're just going to repeat them again until 10 minutes is up. All right? So you're going to see how many rounds you can do in those 10 minutes. All right? so, and so it's just as at your own pace. This is just at your own pace. Uh, however many you can do, as, as intense as you can do them. It's up to you, all right? So, so after after one round of the exercises, you feel like you need to take a break, take a quick second, get some rest, get some water, get jump right back into it, all right? All right so I'm gonna real quick. I'm just gonna make sure I'm, uh, everything's set up for me. All right. All right, so before we do anything else, though, uh, and real, before, I, before I forget again, I'll be using my water bottles as weights. Whatever you want to use, if you want to use your own weights, use your own weights. If you want to use water bottles, cans, uh, you know, you want to grab, you know, actual chairs and use those as weights. That's up to you. Uh, but I'm gonna be using these water bottles. So before we do anything else, we gotta stretch, right? We gotta stretch and warm up. Okay, so. I'm on my chair, I'm at the front of my chair, I'm never leaning back or slouching. Sit up straight, back straight, to the front, make sure your core is activated. All right, we're gonna start from the top and work our way down. All right, so stretch our necks, look up, look down, look up, down. All right, now we're gonna look side to side. Tilt the head, side to side. Here we go, so let's roll, roll our neck a little bit. And our other side. All right, let's get those shoulders. Take one arm, cross the body. Put the other arm on the forearm, or on the bicep, or on the tricep, rather. Never, never on the elbow. No joints, no, no on the wrist. Never on, never on your joints. All right, switch arms. Hope everyone's having a good day today. Get those triceps. All right. You can't quite get your elbow up all the way. Totally fine. Only come up as far as you can. All right, switch arms. All right, we're gonna open up and stretch out, stretch out that hip a little bit. So we're just gonna do a roll around like this. Other side. Now, if you're doing this and you wanna stand up and do this, just go like that. I'm gonna go to the other side. All right, let's stretch out those quads, quadriceps, your thigh muscles. All right, so I'm gonna grab onto my chair. All right, take one leg. Make sure you bend your knee. You don't, never want to just stick your, make your leg straight like that. All right, not only will that you know not feel good, 
All right, you're going to lessen your, your center of gravity. So make your knees bent, make sure you have a strong base. All right, other side. Now, if you don't want to hold on to your chair, you just want to stand like that. So yeah, see how well you can balance. Remember, strength your balance, make sure you got a slight bend in that knee. All right, now let's stretch out our calves a little bit. We're gonna be using our calves today at some point, so we're gonna stretch those out a little bit. So what you wanna do is step forward, take one leg back, make sure that heel is on the ground, and lean, lean from the hip. All right, keep that heel down and lean from the hip. Good stretch. Feeling good. All right, switch legs. Step forward. Make sure that heel is down. Lean, lean from, from, bend from the hip. Good job, good job, looking good. All right, I'm gonna sit back down. We're gonna stretch out those hamstrings a little bit. All right, stretch, stretch your, stick your legs up. Then lean forward. Make sure you're always bent, whenever you lean forward or bend forward, always bend from the hip. See how far down you can reach. Now, see, I'm grabbing my shins right now. See if you can grab your toes, your ankles, or if you can only come up to your quads, you know. That's, that's all right. See how far down you can go. Very good, come back up. All right. Now we gotta warm up a little bit, all right? So, sit in front of your chair. Let's do some arm circles, all right? Circle and forward. All right, let's go the other way, like that. All right, now let's just kind of swing them across the body. Just like that. Kind of loosen them up, all right? All right, let's loosen up those legs a little bit too. All right, those are, so we're just gonna do some leg swings, swing forward and back. Kind of relax the leg, let it go. All right, switch side. Other leg. Just, just let go, just relax the muscles in your legs and just let it swing. Alright. Now let's get moving a little bit more. Alright. So let's do some high knees. Add a little extra, pump those arms. You want to go a little higher? Kick it up like that. Want to come back down here? Right there. If you need to hold on to your chair, you can do that too. Just stand like that. All right. Just keep those legs moving. Get the heart rate up a little bit. Remember, go at your own pace, do what you can do. You only do one leg at a time, see if you can go a little higher. Like that. All right, I think we're warm enough. 
All right, everybody. We're getting ready for our first set of amaranths, or just one amaranth. All right. Remember, this one's 10 minutes long. All right, it's 10 minutes long, just go at your own pace. All right, so only go, only go as fast as you wanna go and only go and do as many rounds as you feel like you can, all right? But as long as you're moving in those 10 minutes, that's what's most important, okay? So if, if you know, only do, only do as many rounds as you feel like you can do, all right? All right, so don't, don't, don't try and push yourself to do more than you can. That's really what I'm trying to get at. All right, don't hurt yourself. All right, so we're doing four, four exercises during, during this AMRAP, all right? We're doing 10 reps of each, okay? Kind of. We're doing, it's, it's gonna be a lot of lower body, okay? We're doing 10 reps of each, but we're doing like 10 on each leg on some of them, all right? So, so it's gonna be, it's gonna probably be like more like 20 on some, sometimes, but is yeah, you'll, you'll see, all right? So we're doing high knee, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, all right, so first, high knees, like we were just doing with our warm up. Next, big steps, we're skaters, so we're just gonna do Kind of big, stepping big to the side like that. Okay. All right, butt kicks. And toe taps, okay? So, you know, butt kicks and toe taps. Okay, on the high knees, on the butt kicks, and on toe taps, all right, we're doing 10 on each leg. Okay, so 10 reps on each leg, so that's so that's one, two, one, two, two, and so forth. Okay. So 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 on those, so I'll keep I'll keep reminding you. So it's high knees, skaters or big steps, butt kicks, and toe taps. And I'll keep reminding you uh, whether how many reps you're doing and how many reps you're doing on each on each leg. Okay. So let's get this timer ready. I have ten minutes on the clock. Okay. I'm gonna be moving, same as y'all. Or these 10 minutes. Okay? So, always be moving. Go at your own pace. Let's see how many you can do in these 10 minutes. All right? On your mark, get set, go. Let's do it. All right, timer's going. 10 high knees. One, two, three, four, five, So I just did 10 on each leg, okay? So now, big steps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right? So I just did 10, all right? Now, now butt kicks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten. All right. Now toe taps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. So that was one round. That was one round. It took about a minute. Okay. So we could so we could potentially get a lot of these rounds. Yeah. Okay, so, all right, so that was one round. All right, so I'm just going to repeat. Remember, go at your own pace. I'm going to just keep going. Follow me, like you can do that too. Alright. See, I'm just here to show y'all what you show y'all what to do. Alright, this is your workout. All right, 
I'm gonna let y'all know when the timer's done, okay? All right, so I'm gonna step it up on this next, I'm gonna step it up a little bit on this next round. All right, so I'm gonna go a little faster, I'm gonna go a little harder, okay? But do, do what you can do, okay? So timer's still going, so you keep going. If you, if you wanna take a break, take a break. If you wanna just keep moving through the rounds, keep going, all right? So I'm gonna step it up a little bit. All right. Get some water. Remember, timer's still going, so you keep moving. All right. All right. We got six minutes left. We got plenty of time. All right. Now I'm going to show y'all how you can do it with this chair. All right. It's easy. It's really, just that easy. Just hold on to it. Just do that. On these big steps, what you can do, just hold on to this, move to one side, hold on to it, just kind of do that, kind of just a big step, literally, just a big step. All right, now it's time, now it's time for butt kicks. One. Keep it moving, keep it moving. Good job, everybody. All right, toe tap. So I'm just gonna hold on to one side. Go a little slower. All right, all right, so I'm gonna repeat everything again, all right? Now with toe taps, usually some see people have, you know, something other than the floor or the ground to tap their foot on, okay? So you're going to grab, I don't know, something a little higher, some sort of level in your house and do the toe taps, do that, all right? So you're not just kind of doing that, you can do kind of keep your, keep your feet up a little bit, all right? All right, four and a half minutes, keep it moving. Got plenty of time, all right? Gators. All right, remember, you can do every, everything, everything that I'm doing, you can do from a chair, either on your chair or, or just kind of, or kind of, you know, holding on to your chair. All right, butt kicks. Back toe taps. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. Timer's still going, so keep moving. All right. About three, three and a quarter minutes left. All right. This time, I'm going to do everything sitting down. I'm going to show you all how you can do that. Okay. All right, so just keep moving. I'm just showing, keep doing what you're doing if you like what you're doing. All right, so I'm just going to show you something you can do. Okay, so remember, it's front of the chair, back straight, core activated. All right, so high knees. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, big steps. Okay, so it's a little different than 
you know, for standing up, okay? So these big steps, just kind of step out. Yeah, step out wide. And this time, if you're doing, if you're sitting down and having to do this, then do 10 on each leg, okay? So four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Okay, so butt kicks might be a little difficult for this one, all right? So I would just recommend just kind of doing 10 more big steps, okay? So it's a little hard to kind of kick your feet back when you're sitting down like this. Okay, so I just say, just do this again. All right, and then back to toe taps, okay? So 10 toe taps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, so we basically just did that whole round of sitting from the chair, okay? So that's just me showing you what you can do. All right, keep moving. Got a minute and a half left. Finish strong, okay? You know, if you finish a round and you start a new round, all right, just don't worry about if you're going to be able to finish that round or not, okay? So just keep moving until the timer stops. Okay, don't ever just stop because you think time's about to run out, all right? All right, so if you're not going to be able to finish a round, then don't finish a round, okay? Just keep moving until the timer stops, okay? Somebody, I'm going to step it. All right, go again. Three. All right, big step skaters. All right, butt kick. Take a minute, catch your breath. All right, it is really nice outside today. Yeah, so I really wanted to do this outside, get some fresh air. Oh, it feels good. Whew. All right, if you want to do this outside too, you know, it's no one to stop you. You know, I, I myself, don't, I'm not a big fan of the sun, okay? So that's why, I like, that's why I'm doing this in the shade. So we got plenty of time to rest, so don't worry. All right, back to it. All right, so this next round, let's look here. All right, so this next round looks like it's going to be a lot of core, a lot of core exercises, okay? So it's going to run the same amount of time as the last set. It's going to run for 10 minutes, okay? It's going to run for 10 minutes, and each, each exercise we're doing 15 of each, okay? Doing 15. All right, so first, first we're going to do crunches. All right, we're going to do you know, sit up here, crunches. Okay, then leg lifts. Just going to do some leg lifts. All right, then the third one, we're only doing three this time, but the third one is like, like arches or rainbows, if you will. All right, so you're going to start from one side, kind of bring your legs over to the other side, kind of make a big arch. Just like that, all right? Now, if you need to, I'd recommend, you know, always sit at the front of your chair, but kind of grab onto the back of the seat, okay? So, you know, it's kind of good for leg lifts and then for those arches, like that, okay? There. So we're gonna do 15 of each of those, okay? So you're really gonna to start to feel it in kind of your core, your upper core, you know, your kind of up, your upper abs and your lower abs, all right? And we're doing 15 of each and we're doing, doing it for 10 minutes. Okay, so 
See how many rounds you can do. Think about how many rounds you did last time and see if you can either, either match that or beat that. Okay, don't, don't, per, don't push yourself to where it hurts. All right, just see, see if you can do that, okay? <laughs> see what you can do. Really challenge yourself to, see, to kind of push out from your comfort zone, okay? All right, so let's get it moving. All right, get your water, wipe yourself off because we're going here in three, two, one. Let's go, let's go. Remember, first off, 15 crunches, okay? So you can either kind of just do them like that, or you can lift your legs at the same time, lift your knees at the same time. So I did 15. All right, so now it's leg lifts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 12, 13, 14, 15. All right, so those, all right, so those arches, okay? So it's not 15 on each side, so we're not doing one and then one and then two, and then two. All right, so it's 15 total. Okay, so you don't have to worry about doing them twice in one set, okay? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, okay? Now remember wherever your feet landed on that on the last round, because what I want you to do is start from that side on the next one. Okay? So like on this next round, I'll probably start over here with the arches. Kind of even it out a little bit. Okay? See how much time we got left. Alright, eight minutes. Alright, eight minutes. So keep moving. Alright, don't worry about if I'm doing anything, okay? This is your workout. Okay? So the timer's going, regardless. The timer's moving. But you keep you keep moving as well. Okay, so remember crunches, leg lifts, arches. 15 of each. Alright, so keep moving. Alright, I'm gonna get back to it. Alright, I'm, I'm I'm gonna keep my feet on the ground this time just to, just to kind of show y'all what, what you can do. Alright, so that is the only time I would say you can kind of bend your back a little bit, all right? Because you're doing crunches, okay? You're not, no one's doing crunches like that. Okay? Kind of, kind of really activate that core. All right, so I did 15. All right, so now I'm going to leg lifts. Come on. Okay, so okay, so this so last time I ended over here, so I'm gonna start over here. Okay, there's something, you know, something to something to think about. You don't have to do that, like you can start wherever. Alright, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15. All right. All right, I'm gonna get some water real quick. Remember, go at your own pace. Take your time, go at your own pace, okay? If you feel like I'm going too fast, then don't go as fast as me. Think I'm going too slow? Go a little faster. Do, see what you can do. Take a look. All right, five and a half minutes. Right, five and a half minutes. There's plenty of time to get as many rounds as you can get. 
Alright, back to it. Crunches. You can also feel it kind of in those hip flexors or in your thighs, even. All right, now back to those arches. I think it's four, three or four. All right, but keep moving. All right, all right. Take a look at the minute time. Four minutes. All right. We have got. We have four minutes. We have plenty of time. All right. Take your water. All right. So don't worry about if I'm moving. All right. You keep moving. All right. Don't worry about if I'm moving and, you, or and you're not, you need to take a minute. Just take a minute. Okay? All right, 15 crunches, back to it. Fifteen, all right. Fifteen leg lifts. Right. More. Okay. Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. All right, all right. Back to arches. Two minutes, 15 seconds. Two and a quarter minutes. Okay, keep moving. All right, remember, if you're grabbing onto the back of that chair, don't lean into the chair, okay? Now that's not helping anybody, okay? So if you lean back, grab on, but don't, don't lean on the back, okay? Keep that core, keep that core strong. All right, and that's, and that's when you're doing the leg lifts and the arches, okay? So never lean on the back of your chair. Always want to sit the front, kind of keep your back straight. Excuse me. Okay. So never lean on the back. It might feel good, it might be comfortable. Alright, but you're not working out anything. Okay, everything's relaxed and you're not working anything. Okay, let's do it. 15 crunches. Four. All right, 15 crunches. All right, so now when you see me doing my crunches, or yeah, I'm putting my hands on my temples. All right, that's just how I was taught. And that's how I was taught to do sit-ups and crunches. Okay, you can put your hands here, do that, you know, or do that. All right, put the back of your neck, or, or yeah, here or back of your head. You gonna do that? It's up to you. All right, if you don't want to use your hands at all, kind of do that. Kind of, it's up to whatever you want to do. All right. All right, take crunches, back to leg lifts. Six, seven, 
15. Alright, 15 leg lifts, back to arches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, see, timer ran out. Stop moving, take a break. All right, so you see, I wasn't able to finish that round or even that set. Okay, so but that's fine. All right, as long I was I was moving during the entire thing. Okay, I didn't stop moving because I knew the timer was about to run out. Okay, so just that's all that's all that matters as long as you're moving. All right, so rest up, get some water. All right, take a minute, wipe yourself off, do what you need to do. Alrighty. Alright, let's look at the next section. Next left round. Alright, so this next AMRAP, wrap. Let's see. Alright, so this next ram AMRAP wrap is the last one. Okay, we're not. It's not gonna be the end of the workout. All right. So, but just keep that in mind. This is the last AMRAP. wrap. Okay. So for this one, we will be using our weights, whatever it is. Okay. So I have my water bottles. All right, so that's what I'll be using. All right, since I'm working from home, I don't really, ha I don't have too many weights at home. Okay, so I want to use something that I have. Okay. All right, so ten rep, ten minutes, ten minutes, of, ten minutes, as many rounds as possible. We're doing fifteen reps of each set. Okay. Fifteen reps. All right, so it's going to be all kind of upper body, upper body weights. So shoulders, overhead press. Chest, chest fly, and then our backs are bent over row. Okay, <clears throat> so we're doing those three overhead, chest fly, bent over rows. Th those three, 15 each, and for 10 minutes. Okay, so remember now those 10 minutes might seem like it's going a little fast or slow, depending on how how, how much you're moving, right? Now, if it's moving fast, then uh, then you're having fun. That's what that's how the saying goes, all right. It's going a little slow. That means you have you're giving yourself plenty of time to do as many rounds as you can. Okay. All right. So give you give you a couple more seconds and get get myself set up here. Okay. Now, remember, ten minutes overhead press, chest fly, bend over a row, fifteen of each. One, two, three, go. All right. Grab my legs. 15 overhead press. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 12, 13, 14, 15. 15 chest fly. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 12, 13, 14, 15. All right, bend over right. One, two, three, number four, five. Keep those elbows close. Six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, so that was one round. All right, so I'm gonna keep moving. Okay, and remember when you're doing those bent over rows, keep your back straight, and bend from the hips. All right, remember really squeeze those muscles at whatever the top is. All right, so if you're up here, yeah, keep, keep it, yeah, really, really push into it. All right, when you're doing the fly, really, and then back bend over row, really squeeze at the top, okay? Remember when you're doing the bend over row, keep your elbows close to your body, okay? All right, keep moving, keep going, keep going, okay? Time is still going. All right, back to it. Six. 
six. Let's fly. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. All right, back to bend over rows. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. All right, all right, keep going. Timer's still moving, timer's still going. Okay, all right, you have seven minutes left. Keep going. Okay, now remember when you're doing these, you want to keep good form. Okay, so when you're doing the overhead press, you don't want to go like that. That's not helping anybody. Okay, same here. Or you know, don't go don't go fast just to run through it and see how many you can do. Okay, you gotta have good form so you're really doing all of the workout. Okay, you wanna have good form and then you wanna you don't wanna you know just be going to be going. Okay, that's not helping anybody. You might even be hurting yourself. Okay, so always have good form and remember, don't just drop the weights. Okay, so if you're up here, don't just let go. Or you know, don't don't go or and then just drop, okay? Like I've said, I've said a couple, I've said many times. Half the workout is the extension, and the other half is coming back down. Okay? It may not seem like you're activating those muscles when you're coming back down from whatever it is, alright, but you are. Okay, you got you've got to control those muscles so that the weights don't, don't just drop. Okay, so that's why that's half the workout. Alright, so Timer's still going, so keep moving. You know, I'm just, I'm just kind of giving some pointers and some tips, okay? But you should still be moving, okay? Remember, 15, overhead press, a 15 up chest fly, 15, bend over row. Okay, so I'm just doing it to show y'all what you, what you do. I'm giving some tips along the way, okay? But you should still be moving. Okay, overhead press, let's go. Remember, this is your workout. Chest fly. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. All right. Then over a row. Let's go. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. All right, let's take a look at that time. All right, got four minutes left. Four, four minutes, fifteen seconds. Right, let's keep going. All right, so plenty of time. All right, see how many rounds you can do. See how many reps, and see how many rounds you can do. All right, think of how many rounds you did the last time. See if we do more than that, okay? Kind of think of a number of how many you want to do to reach that goal, okay? You know, again, like I said, if you're in the middle of a round and the timer stops, it's okay, all right? That just means you were moving the entire time, all right? It's not a matter of completing the round, okay? You always want to try and complete the round, okay? But it's not the biggest deal if you don't, okay? It's kind of like winning. Like, it's always important to win. You always want to try and win, okay? But as long as you're, you know, you're good and you're a good player, that's equally as important. All right, you should always try and win. Do it your best to try to win. All right, but as long as you, as long as you're a good player, that's equally as important. Three, four, five, six, seven, 
10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. All right, and let's do another round. Let's take a look at the time. All right, two minutes, 15 seconds. All right, so it's plenty of time. You can easily get a couple more rounds in if you can, if you want if you want to go for it, okay? Keep moving, timer's still going. Let's keep moving. All right, I'm gonna go back to it. Overhead press. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay. Chest fly, 15. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. All right. Keep going. All right, you got a minute left, so really push it. See, it, see if you can finish up right. If you see if you can start and finish another round in this minute, okay? See what you can do. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15. All right. Yeah, almost there. All right, keep moving. We're almost there. Six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. All right, timer's still going. Keep moving. We're not done yet. All right, now we're done. Timer stops. All right, take a minute, take a break, get some water. All right, we're not done yet. We're not done with our workout yet. We're getting close, okay? But just keep moving. Here, nice. take a minute, take a break, get some water, do what you need to do. <laughs> Good. Now, at the beginning, Remember, I had you stretch out your calves. Okay, I had to do some warm up stretches with the calves because <coughs> that's how we're going to be using our calves. All right, this is when we're doing it. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to set a timer for a minute. Okay, I set a timer for a minute. And you're going to see how many calf raises you can do. You can either do sit seated calf raises, just like that. You can just sit up, back straight, and just lift lift your heels off the floor, do your heels off the ground. All right, or you can stand up. Do standing calf raises, okay? All right, I'm gonna do standing calf raises, okay? But feel, remember, feel this is your workout. So if you want to do seated calf raises, that's fine, okay? I'm gonna do standing calf raises, okay? So if you're doing standing calf raises, hold on, grab onto your chair. Again, just lift from the heels, just like that, okay? All right, so I'm gonna give you give you some more time, rest up, get some water. All right, move myself out of the way. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and set my timer. Okay. Hope everyone's feeling good. Hoping they're having a good day so far. All right. All right, so everyone get ready. All right, get yourself ready. Sit down, stand up, whatever it is you need to do. Okay, we're doing, we're going to, all right, so I'm going to set the timer. We're going to do this five times, okay? So we're going to do the set the timer. It's going to go for a minute. All right, see how many calf raises you can do in that minute. 
All right, let me give you a few seconds. Then I'm gonna go again, see, how many, see if you can do more than that, okay? So the time is gonna stay the same, okay? See you, how many you can do, see how many if you can push yourself to really uh, see as many as you can do in that minute, okay? All right, everyone get ready. We're gonna be going here in a minute, in a second. On your mark, get set, go. All right, minutes, minute on the clock, let's do it. Remember, good form. Don't go, don't go crazy fast. All right. Remember, count your calf raises. See how many you can do. Got to turn on pace. Remember, this is your workout. So don't worry about how many I'm doing. See how many you can do. Good, good. Good job. Keep going. Now we're still going. I often feel in workouts like these, or just any workouts in general, like in a class setting, calves are usually neglected. All right, but they're important. Okay, there we go. Time's up, that was a minute. Hey. All right, so that was a minute. Think of how many you did. I'm pretty sure I did 34. Okay, I did 34. All right, how many you did? That's what's in, that's what's important. Okay. All right, so I think I did 34. Yeah, I did 34. All right, so I'm gonna see if I can do 35 at the very least. Okay. Now, if you don't if you don't do more, if you only match, or if you don't do as many as you did the pre previous time, who cares? You got your calves moving. Okay. Okay, so all, all I'm wanting to do is encourage yourself, encourage y'all to push yourself and to really see, really challenge you, just challenge what you think you can do, okay? All right, again, another minute. We'll do this five times, we'll do it four more times, okay? On your mark, get set, go. Keep moving. Good job, everybody. Thirty-six, thirty-seven. Okay, all right, take a break. Take a minute. Take a break. All right, I did forty-two that time. All right, so I beat my goal. All right, see how many I can do this time. Okay. Take a second. Probably start to feel it in your calves a little bit. You might find that your calves are, you know, not as strong as. Uh, as, you know, not as strong as the rest of your body. Okay, that's what I'm trying to get. Trying to get them worked up. Okay. All right. Three, two, one. Let's go. Back to it. Standing calf raises or seated calf raises. Good job. Good job, everybody. Feet that start bothering you, bothering you. Just kind of rest for a second. Just loosen them up. All right, back to it. Really, just see how many you can do. Third round. There we go. Two more. All right. I count. I lost count. I lost track of how many I I done at that point. I lost count. Okay. So I don't remember what I did. Okay. 
Probably wasn't probably wasn't 42. As many as 42 because I kind of took a break, kind of stopped in between. All right, but doesn't matter. We're all we're doing a lot of calf races, okay? So we're getting our calves, really getting working our calves and getting them getting them built up, bulked up. Okay. All right. Second round, last round, oh, fourth round. Ready, set, go. Uh, good job, everybody. Keep it going. Remember, don't go crazy. Don't don't do that. That's that's nothing. That's nothing. All right. Really. Go up. Back down. Don't don't try to beat your record for the sake of beating your record. All right. You want good good exercises. All right. Loosen my foot up a little bit there. See what you can do. Remember, see what push yourself, but with good form. All right, that's that should be your mantra. Push yourself with good form. All right, now you don't ever want to. You never want to really beat yourself, beat whatever record you have for the just for the sake of doing that. You want to make sure you're getting a good workout at the same time. Okay, so if that means not doing as many as you did the first time, that's fine. All righty, last round. One minute on the clock. Let's go. Finish strong. Finish strong in this one. Finish strong. Keep it moving. Keep going, keep going. We're getting there, we're getting close. Good job, everybody. All right, time's up, that was, lit. That was it. Guess what, everybody? Our workout's done. All right, we're done. Now it's time to cool down. All right, so shake it off. Shake it off a little bit. All right, so since we just did a lot with our calves, we're going to stretch those out first. Okay, so remember, step forward, step, step back, put that back heel, make sure it's firmly on the ground, bend from the hip. All right. Since we did a lot of calves right there at the very end, probably going to feel them. You're probably going to feel them. Good, good job, everybody. All right, other leg. Now bend forward, keep your back straight, and bend from the hips. Keep that back heel down. Uh, all right, I'm gonna sit back down. All right, we're gonna stretch out that hip a little bit, okay? So if you can cross your legs like this, do that. If not, just kind of, just kind of put them, put your legs, put your leg where you can. All right, so I'm gonna do this. Back straight. Then lean forward. Remember, you can't put your leg up like this. Don't worry about it. All right, just put it where you can, and then lean forward. All 
Alright, switch legs. Good job, good job everybody. Stretch out the shoulder a little bit because we did a lot of shoulders today. So, arm across. Didn't really, really feel that stretch. Remember, don't put your arm, don't put your arm on the joints. Don't put anything on the joints. All right, switch arms. All right, kick those feet up, lean forward, bend from the hips, remember, lean from the hips, stretch out those hamstrings. Come back up. All right, one more time. Uh, see how that far you can go. And come back up. That's it for today, everybody. Hope everyone's had a good day. You did great. All right. And stay safe out there.